Ladies and boys and girls, in this video I will show you how to animate like Keanu visuals in After Effects. So this is not an exact replica of Keanu visuals video. There are some slight changes. Yeah, so let's get into the video. Create a new comb with 1080, height 9020, duration of 5 seconds. Let me add a background video. On the right side, there is an option called Tracker. If you don't see it, go to the window, Tracker. Now select the video and select Track Motion. Select this track point and place it where you want to track the camera. So I will put this in SD card right here. Make sure the point which you are setting is high contrast area. Click on this analyze forward option. After effects will automatically track the subject. Add a new null object. Right click new null object. Select this edit target, select the null layer, press OK. Let me close this panel. Create a new comb with 1080, height 9020. Select the router rectangle tool and create a shape like this. Select this transparent icon. Let me change the rounded shape color to black. I'm going to add a video into the timeline. Below the shape layer, change track mat to shape layer. Let me adjust the position a little bit. Now I'm going to add a rounded rectangle box on top like this. Add some test. Go back to main comb and add the SD card comb below the null layer. Let me adjust the position, set the speak with tail and add it to the null object. Let me go back to SD card comb. I want to make this more rounded. For doing this under the shape layer, rectangle 1, rectangle path 1, Increase the roundness. Do the same for the shape layer. Let me create another one. Go to view and check show rulers. Let me add the lines like this. With the help of guidelines, we don't get confused with the height and width of rectangle shape layer. Do the same steps as we done before. Add a rounded shape layer, change color to black. Add video below the shape layer. Track mat, select shape layer. Create another shape layer, add test. Add this to the main comb. Place it below the main tracking. Add this big tail to the main tracking. Let me add gradient ramp to the background video. Start and end color to black. Ramp shape radial ramp. Blend with original to 70%. 
let me add a chest add the speed tail to the main tracking so now we are animating the second scene create a new comb with 1080 height 90 20 add a background video select tracker motion place the tracker point over here click on this analyze forward option add a new null object set edit target press ok now click on apply create a new comb with 1080 height in 1920 let me import some videos first let me add this video into the timeline scale 50 add a new rounder shape layer like this add a shape layer rectangle path 1 let me increase the roundness set the video change track map to shape layer now go to this project panel create a duplicate of this video comb by pressing ctrl plus d or command plus d set the next video from project panel and add the video from timeline hold alt key and add this video in here again create a duplicate of video to comb do the same steps add the next video in here by holding alt key Let me go back to main comb, add this video comb into the timeline, place this below the tracking null object. Let me select all these video combs, change scale size to 50. Add a new null object, rename it as rotation. Let me place this tracking null object above this background video. Select all the video comb and rotation null object, make it 3D open position and chase the z-axis to 500. Set the video comb and add the speed with tail to the rotation null object. Change the wire rotation to 60. For next video comb, add speed tail to the rotation null object. Change the wire rotation to 60 multiply 2 which is 120. Do the same for the next video comb. Change Y rotation to 60 multiply 3 which is 180. For next video comb, Y rotation 60 multiply 4 which is 240. For next video comb, change rotation to 60 multiply 5 which is 300. So now this is where I made a mistake. You need 6 videos but in this scenario I only have 5 videos. So create a duplicate of video 5 comb. Add another video. Select the video on timeline and this newly added video. Hold Alt key and add it in here. Let me go back to main comb, add this video syscomb in timeline. Make it 3D. Add this big tail to the rotation comb. Change the wire rotation to 60 multiply 6 which is 360. Push on top. And change C axis to 1000. Set keyframe for wire rotation. Go few press forward and change the wire rotation. Again go few press forward and change the wire rotation. Easy all keyframes. Open graph editor and adjust the speed graph like this. Let me select all the video comb and over position and hold shift and press T 
to open opacity. Set keyframe for position and opacity. Place these keyframes over here. Go at the beginning, change the position down. Opacity 0. Easy is all keyframes. Yeah, and that's it, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. If you found this video useful, give a like, subscribe to my channel if you like these kind of tutorial videos, and I will see you on my next video.